Welcome to Risk Live. I'm a grandmaster at this game, always trying to share tips and tricks to help you get better while we try to improve and have some fun, hopefully. We're playing our Novice to Grandmaster series, playing Auto Match. This is game 29. We come into this rank or er, with a rank points of 17,966 and a rank of Master. We've got to get to 26,000 to become a Grandmaster. We have a record of 20 and 8. And we're in the second position. Looks like, oh man, look at that. Australia. What an incredible spawn for Australia and South America. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. They're going to probably come after me pretty hard if I try and take both of those. Black's going to maybe position himself to take South America, maybe? I don't know, but we definitely take this on turn one. Gonna want an ally here, aren't we? Who wants to be our ally? Let's ally with everybody. <laughs> okay, so white's second best choice would be Africa? But he can't get in there from where he's at. His easy take would have been moving into South America. Or here. Or here. But he doesn't know where red wants yet. Red is heavy up here. Red maybe moves down. He tries to get South America. White didn't get a good roll. And he's attacking too many times. Yeah, why Why did he attack so many times? White must be a beginner. That's going to put him in a tough position. And, and I don't think anybody has a clue as to where he wants to go. <laughs> I don't have a clue where he wants to go. Looks like he's going to provide a buffer for me in Australia. Does red hit five on three? Or four on one? And then pull down. Red could go for North America. He's in a good position for North America. A lot of troops. A lot of troops in North America. Okay, black moves in here. Black moves out. Black doesn't do anything. Okay, that's weird. I guess I'll get my take here. That worked. I should have probably just left those as twos. Consolidated up here. I don't know if black wants up here or over here. Red has their pick. Red could consolidate here and take South America pretty easily. I think we'll leave this at about a... F well, we'll see what white does here. But we'll probably just stack everything outside. And leave this not very big. That way we're in a position to take some kills if the opportunity arises.
we'll get our take here. That way we'll have this corner piece. And then we'll combine over here. Yeah, I think red's going to go for North America. Red's going to have a strong position if he captures North America pretty quickly. Got a two stuck here. I think we'll stick to the plan that we had. gives black away out of here. Boy, white is killable, isn't he? <clears throat> Not looking to take a kill. But white is definitely in trouble. Red could feed the kill if Red takes North America. No trade. Black with the trade. Black with the big trade. Still can't tell what he's trying to do. Okay, he wants he does want this one. a six over. All right, that works. trade and I lost my cards hmm see what red does if he if he gets out of this position I might have to take that position black might take it as a threat red's got to take this as a little bit of a threat
Red matches it. Takes his bonus. Hmm. I think we got to break red. What do you think? Okay, black wants to attack red with me. Perfect. Oh, black wants this bonus. He's not going to hit red over here. That's going to be rough for us, because I still don't have a big trade. Black had a trade. If I hit red here, red can come through here and hit me. So we're going to see, well, if white attacks black, I would have hit red. Oh, okay. Okay. I will go after red. I will go after red since he broke black. Although I still need, did I get my card? I didn't get a card. Not a good one. That sucks. Oh, I forgot I was going to take this one and park there. Hmm. Now red gets to defend. Red won't have a trade, so he he won't be able to break this if I break him over here. But he might send all of his troops into me. Black's on 24. Black is killable for three cards. Yeah, black wants me to attack red. We're gonna mix it up. We're definitely gonna mix it up here. Red's on 11. We're just gonna park that right there. No trade. Oh, white with the low trade. Black could kill white on the next turn if black has a trade. So white needs to break black. Because black could kill him whether he trades or not. I mean, whether he breaks or not. 
so you might as well break. Dude, white is awesome. <laughs> Whoa, that was amazing. Okay, so let's hope black doesn't have a trade on three. Highly likely white dies here. He shouldn't have opened black. Black's 15. Now he's going to hide in the corner. Don't hit this one. Don't hit that one. No, he needed to leave this one here. Uh, leave that there because black would have had to split so red may end up feeding the kill to black this is going to be another quick game for sure does red go for the black red takes the black kill right now white just fed the kill to black so that's why white ended up doing that white fed the kill to fed black's kill to red So with red's trade, he could end up breaking me. Red could end up breaking me. Let's hope he doesn't get a big trade. Let's hope he doesn't get a big trade. He could end up killing white, too. He's got enough troops to kill white. Fortunately, I have a big stack. He did get the big trade, didn't he? No, he got an eight. It's still enough to take me out of here. But he would be killable. Oh, is he going for the kill on white? Or is he going to hit me? What does he do? He feed. He's feeding the white kill to me. I'm killing both of them. Perfect. That's perfect. Red's going to be on three cards. Red's got a... <laughs> wow. All right. Well, I'm... I got to give white second. White was the instrumental. Instrumental. In making this a quick game. That was amazing. Let's do that. split here. Come on, dice. This is going to be close. Oh, shit. We don't have it. Come on. No! <laughs> can't get it white gets the kill on red
White gets the kill on red <clears throat> and potential advantage going into the end game. That sucks. That was one off. I should have counted that. I should have counted that a little bit better and maybe blitzed with a two up here so I didn't have to leave a three. Let's hope he gets a small trade, not a big trade. We have a cannon trade. I think we're okay. I think we'll be okay. He'll be on four, but I should be able to win this. We have a massive advantage. Oh, he had a small trade. No, he had a big trade. Okay. Is he going to try for it? Yeah, we got decent there. He loses two on our three. Yeah, he's definitely not going to be able to break me everywhere. <laughs> he's not breaking Australia. Four, three, two, might be able to break this. But it's over. Ha! <laughs> ha! Look at the dice. Didn't even, do, didn't even slow roll. It's hilarious. Well played. That is a GG. Another fast game. You love it. Love to see it. Doesn't matter where I go. Boom. In and out. Nice quick one. We got time for another one. Let's see where the rank ends up. Beginner, beginner. Black was an expert. So, yeah, white. White instrumental in making that quick win possible by hitting black and allowing us to focus on red. And because of that, we gave white second place. Hey, we get some gems, finally. Not that I can buy anything with it. All right, we're at... That's so interesting. 18,747. Didn't that just say 19? And then it changed? That was weird. 18,749. Oh, no, I think I was looking at the 17,966. So there's another win on the board. And that brings us our 21st win. We are now 21 and 8 with a 72% win rating. 